Hi guys. So we've been asked this week uh, by parents of a child with special needs, could we give some advice um, around them setting up the financials correctly for make sure that the, the future of, of their child is, is secured. And we've been doing this work for quite a number of years now. Um, and we've been asked just to put together some sort of information just to give a, a bit of a guidance. So this week's blog is all about that. Um, it's all about how to set up your financials correctly when you have a child or children with, with additional needs. And we look at things like setting up the correct bank account, um, what benefits you may be entitled to, what allowances are there. So we've listed them all in the blog, or as many of them as we can can think about. Um, you know, some common mistakes or common issues that people come back to us with is how to set up a bank account correctly, um, how to make sure and ensure that your child with additional needs is financially secure going forward because obviously you're not always your parents are not always going to be here to ensure that so how do we how do we make that happen and how does how did to do that correctly so we we talk about um the correct bank account we talk about you know setting up a life cover trust or a trust life insurance policy where there's a guaranteed payout even after the contract ends there's a guaranteed payout for your child when parents do pass on um, we look at the idea of, of appointing guardians for your children, um, trustees for a will. So we talk about making a will as well. Um, simple things like hospital passports where you can record everything about your child and just hand it to the hospital where if you have to present to it rather than having to go over and over the same stories again. It's all in, it's all in your passport, which makes it easier and more comfortable for parents when there is a lot of stress there anyway. So Anything that can make life easy for you as parents and for your child, obviously, is a thing that we want to get to and the thing that we hope that we have offered some guidance on it, but especially around the financials. And, and this is where people get a little bit confused and some common and easy to make mistakes um, that are very easily corrected once you know. Um, so we've covered a lot of information in the blog. So have a look and have a read. We've also a worksheet or a workbook that we can actually issue out to any parents that want it. Um, and it's literally just to keep you on track on how to actually set up your finances correctly and around what allowances and benefits that you may be able to claim. So we can forward the you know the, the work the workbook to you. Just get in touch if you want to have a chat about any of the things in the blog. By all means, give us a shout. And setting up your life trust um, and your will, obviously, we would be recommending that very, very, very highly. So, I mean, again, if you need any help or assistance around doing any of that, by all means, give us a shout back. Guys, any questions, as always, we're here um, for all your financial needs.